Well, hello everyone. Today is Wednesday. Wednesday? Yes, Wednesday. You heard me. It's Wednesday. But what kind of Wednesday is it? Well, you know, it looks like I'm in a little bit different area of my room. Because, you know, my room is my art room, my sewing room, my bedroom. It is. Everything happens here. Well, today is April the 17th. This is my 38th video. And I have... 313 subscribers. Thank you very much. I appreciate all your subscribers, all the comments, all the thumbs up, all the good stuff. Thank you very much. Let's get down with the important thing first. My son made a potato casserole. Now it had mashed potatoes and it had some stir fry veggies. So he put the, the potatoes, the stir fry veggies, a little bit more potatoes, and then sprinkled cheese. I haven't had it. I've been waiting to show you. Plus, I have a celery and cucumber onion salad with a little bit of jalapenos and then some biscuits that didn't turn out so well that I baked. This is it. We got your bread, we got your salad, and we got your potato. Well, I put a little dab of sour cream on there because um, what potato don't need a little sour cream? Mm -mm. And then the jalapenos. So let's just get a mix. My mouth is watering. You know why my mouth is watering? Because I'm on a new diet. I know. I said I'd never go on a diet again. My son said, Mom, I know you have tried every... Hold on a second. You're just driving me crazy. Let me get. Let me just get a bite. Mm. Mm. Let me try this bread. Tastes good. It's really dense. I think I got a hold of... Um, uh, some yeast that's not the greatest. <laughs> Whatever. I'm not going to go there. So it's not rising as much as it needs to. But we ate it. This is darn good. Now let me tell you my, my craziness in my life right now. And this will be the last time, I hope. Now, my, my son goes, Mom, have you ever tried this? I was like, I've tried everything. I have tried everything other than getting the uh, surgery, right? Just just cut it out of me. That's how I stop having kids. Just cut it out of me. Because you got to cut it out of me. Or it's going to continue, right? He goes, you know how they do the stomach stable? Yeah, yeah. You know how they give you just a little bit? A food to eat, right? And it's hard to eat a lot. Yeah. Have you ever tried? Um, oh, what did they call it? I should have wrote it down. Um, anyway, you go so many hours. And then you eat. And you have a small window of eating. And then you stop. What is that called? I know you all know it. Mm. Uh, fasting. Intermittent fasting. Ooh, good brain. Good brain. Thank you. Thank you, brain. Thank you, brain. Intermittent fasting. Now, I have been told about intermittent fasting for a long time. Ginger, where are you going? She's digging into the carpet. She got dirty fingers. She, everything's her napkin. Anyway, so, intermittent fasting. I hear it does really great. So I said, okay, I've never tried it. I've thought about it. Never did it because, you know, I was working and I couldn't be around people eating and all that kind of stuff. If I'm going to fast, nobody can eat around me, right? Now I'm retired. 
I got no outside people that are just influencing me. You know what I mean? Look, at you can see the outside in my glasses. Influencing me. So I'm going to give it another go. That's, that's, I don't know why I told you that, but that's the craziness that's going on. Plus, you see that I am in a different area, right? And Wednesdays, to me, are going to change a little bit. Now, it can, some Wednesdays will be, could be the same. Just sitting here talking about quilting, which I'll talk about quilting right now. I did do some work yesterday. Yes, yesterday. I cut out all my my trees and all my houses for the something neighbor quilt. It's over there. Oh, I just dropped all the. I'll pick it up later when I'm not so upset about it. Anyway, we're going on that one. Won't you be my neighbor or uh, holiday? I don't know. Something neighbor, right? I cut all the pieces for that. And now they're all, all down there on the ground. Mm, spread out. I got to put them together. Whatever. But today, this is a new one. Wednesdays can be painting. Watercolor Wednesday. I do... I do planting. I I, I like to uh, mess with plants, repotting, growing plants. I do cross stitch, right? Cross stitch. I do acrylic painting. And I do some faux stained glass. I'm not doing real stained glass no more. But when I show you faux stained glass, I'll bring out a few pieces of my stained glass that I've done to show you. I ain't doing that no more. I'm not cutting myself no more. So that's what I'm doing. This right here, these two right here, which this area I really don't like. And it's going to change because you can't be on my YouTube channel looking so plain. It's got to be full and beautiful and gorgeous. So I'm working on that. You know, I have an idea about that. Tell me if this sounds just absolutely stupid. Now, because Christmas time... I get the idea of putting up the Christmas tree and I want to put all the goodies on it. But, you know, I get my Christmas tree out I and then, you know, you have to, because I have a fake one, you have to straighten it all out. That's all my energy for a Christmas tree. It's done. Now I just turn it on and it blinks. And I'm sick. I'm done with it. I'd like to have things on it, but I don't. Be, and then it's like, well, maybe I'll do it. And then the kid's like, you going to put anything on it? And, you know, it's like... It's pretty like it is. But this is what I was thinking. I'm going to put a shelf right here. And I think I might make it my Christmas shelf. Because I got all kinds of Christmas decorations I want to get rid of. I'm going to pick out my favorite Christmas decorations. And I have a couple small Christmas trees. And just make it my Christmas wall. Does that sound stupid to you? Because my room is red. I like red and pink together. Uh, so, well, what part of the room I have, this just, that's my room right there. That wall, right? That's where my bed, where Ginger's, nope, Ginger's not there. Uh, that's, that's, that's it. It's a twin bed, small bed, but I'm thinking about putting a shelf. But these pictures right here, I don't know if you can see them or not. These pictures were mixed media. So I have inking. I have pointillism, which basically it's just a bunch of dots, right? Uh, the the teapot right there, it's just painted a silver white. And then I went in with a black uh, marker and just made all kinds of, of dots to uh, shade it. And um, let's see, I got inking markers. I don't know if I, I don't, I do have some oil pastels in it. And I know I got oil pastels in this one right here. Um, that was going to be, I was going to do a series and then I stopped. So I don't know if I'm going to continue that series. But, you know, I hope I have a, a thing about pin cushions. I took a picture of a pin cushion on, in like 2021 something. One I did. 
And that's going to be my first piece of art. I have not watercolors for many years. Now, I have done, let me see if I can find one. I have done watercolors. I got one of, oh, gee, many, um, two of my sons. Let's see if I can find it real quick. I don't think I'm going to be able to find it. But anyway, I have done watercolor, basically kind of portrait type things of uh, two of my sons. I have one that I have to finish uh, of one son, and I haven't done it in a many years. Now, watercolor is very interesting. It's fun. It's, uh, it's not like acrylics or oil. Because when you water paint, you paint basically backwards. Because you have to make sure your lights are there before you even go on anywhere. So it's basically like you're painting your light colors before your dark colors. Um, there are some things that I'm using. It's called masking. And what you do, it's like a, 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 a liquid glue. And what you do is you kind of paint where the white colors are going, the really bright whites are going to be in um in your picture and then uh that way you could paint over them and then when you're done painting you kind of use this like eraser and it pulls up all the plastic come on and uh that way you could paint it in there hold on a second come on you know you when you want a picture you can never find it and then when you don't want a picture, it's like, oh, yeah, that picture. Oh, yeah, that picture. Come on. I know I'm close. I know I'm close. Oh, wait. Oh, there's a... Oh, my bread's done. I'm baking bread right now. Do you guys have a bread maker? Because if you don't, you're missing out. <laughs> Come on. Give me one second. Hold, please. Hold. Hold. I know it's real close here. Oh, my goodness. My goodness. Anyway, I've done acrylic paintings. This is this this is not done. This looks terrible. The lighting's not good on it. But this was I'm not gonna show you because it doesn't look that great. Oh come on. I've done look at this is one of the acrylic paintings I've done. It was a door. It's a door. I give that to my sister. Most of my a uh, lot, a lot of my uh, paints, paintings, I've given it to given to my sisters. This is one that I've done. It's just just fat flowers. Um, let's see what else. I'm getting close. I know I am. Mm-hmm. That's not it. And I've done you know cross stitch. This is this is one of my cross stitches that I did. Jalen, um, I should have got this stuff before. I wasn't thinking. I wasn't thinking. That's the problem. I wasn't thinking. Come on. Anyway, I'm about ready to stop, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, this is another one that I painted. Acrylics. I'm getting close, darn it. I know it, because that was about the time. That was many years ago. That's about the time I got that. I got that video, and then that. Oh, my goodness. I got to go through and find it, and then I will show you. I know. You guys are like, okay, go on. You're boring me. I know. Okay, I'm done. Watch it right there, right there. Uh, am I gonna stop? Am I gonna stop? Anyway. Okay, I'm not gonna find it. Maybe next video, I'll find it for you. Whatever. But this is the picture that I'm doing now. It's gonna be in watercolor, right? This is the drawing that I made of it. Now this gray stuff right here, blue stuff, this is masking. And when you do this, I, this board right here, it's not working out. So I, th this is one of the things that I failed at is making an artboard, but uh, I'm, I'll make another one because this is not working. 
And the reason why I tape the paper on here is that way it doesn't buckle. I And with watercolor, it'll buckle a lot. And if you don't get good watercolor, it doesn't go back from unbuckling. So this, I'm trying to make it so it does not... Look, you can see my... You can see me in my picture. Look at me talking in my picture. All right, this is what I'm painting. Today, we are just going to be doing the first pass. Basically, what that is called is you're blocking in. You need to block in, right? Let me get rid of this. I'm going to be blocking in the pin cushion. That just means the first pass of color. Um, so I did do some studies or you figure out what colors I want to use, you know, all this kind of stuff. And so my pin cushion is the red one, so I'm going to go with the red. And this is, uh, oh, here's the noodles here. I'll show you. Hold on. See, these are the colors that I've decided on right here. I just have them in here so that I know these are the colors that I, I put on that thing, right? Here's my, my noodles. <laughs> and my noodles. It's just to prop my picture up is all it is. It wasn't that big a thing or if, you know, we're drowning. I could, I'm going to drown. That kind of stuff. That kind of stuff. Jeez. Oh, should I change? I'm not do. I'm not do redoing this this video. Okay, I have to change glasses because I can't see uh, very well with those, and my lighting is terrible right now. I gotta go. To, I'm gonna go to the secondhand store and get some more um, lamps. I moved from Vegas to here. I got rid of all my lamps. Now I gotta go buy them again. We'll see. Oh, hi. <laughs> okay, one more bite because uh, you're wasting my uh, time, my 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 window of uh, my eatage because I only eat between two and six. Other than that, it's water. Every once in a while, I go crazy, I can eat a stock, uh, a stock of celery. I'm sorry. It's going to go one more time. I'm going to give this a good try. I'm really going to give this a good try. Mmm. Okay. Mmm. Water. I am eating tea too, though. Drinking, not eating. <laughs> okay. So, I am going to be blocking in the pin cushion right here. So I'm going to turn you down so you can see what I'm doing. Hopefully this will work. I think I got it. Okay. You see my picture right here, the one that I'm doing. I'm going to be doing the pin cushion. I'm not going to use this right now. So lay it down. Can you see it better? Lay it down. So what I'm going to do is I'm just and now, now I'm no teacher. I'm just telling you how I do things, right? I'm just and the the trick to watercolor is controlling the moisture, right? So I want to put a wash everywhere this red is going. And if I put a wash over that little, that little, um, this is going to go, I just got these. Oh, heck no. They're not the most expensive things. Anyway, I'm just going to go for the wash where the pin cushions at right here let me get it wet in here and the reason why you do a first wash is just to get color you just want to get color on that picture it's basically what you're doing you just need to get some color <laughs> i always said that art is the ability to fix mistakes because <laughs> basically what you're doing is you're putting stuff down and then fixing the way you want it to, to be at the end. I want to get this paper wet enough so it soaks in a little bit. That way when you put watercolor on paper, it kind of spreads out. That's why paper is so important with watercolors. I wonder if I did that. So basically, and then right here, don't forget those little areas right there. 
and right here no is that no that's not right here right here right here right here right here so basically and you know it could on these wednesdays what what, what you do on wednesday what you do it what what you do on wednesday is basically what it's gonna be called um i don't know I, i'm just calling it water watercolor wednesday today because this is what i got okay i think i got that nice and wet making sure oh i didn't get my hold on hold on i didn't bring my paint brushes close enough i was trying to get all set up i did some playing on the um camcorder mm, didn't go so well all right water um, mop up that voice. So the first color that I will be doing is bright, bright, I don't know, aura or something like that. Uh oh, I got this mixed up. So where it's really super pinky, I don't know if you can see that. See where in the areas where it's super pink, I'm going to be putting that color first. Oh, Jiminy Crickets. Okay, right there. So I'm just gonna wet it in here, like so. Just enough, just where that real bright is at. I just put it in there. It's not very wet, why? I haven't done this in probably seven years. See how it just kind of pulled, fell in there? And if you need it to come out, dry your brush a little bit and just kind of pull it out. I don't want it super bright. And see how you could just kind of just put it in. Like this is my first wash, so it don't have to be perfect. And you can... Can you can take off uh, watercolor? Um, so you know if it's good watercolors. Right now I'm using oh M M Graham. No, these are not. These are my Mission Golds uh, watercolor paints. Uh, they're really good. They're you know uh, these have been put away for I'd say seven years. And I took them out and touched them and they were still sticky because they use uh, honey in them. I'm just getting my first pass done. So how are you guys doing? You doing good? I'm doing all right. I'm really going to try with this diet. I think I'm really going to, I mean, you know, all right. I've been on a lot of diets and I don't do so well. But I think I'm really going to try this time. It's not like I didn't try all the other times. I tried for a little while. But after, you know, three or four days, it's like, oh, no, we don't need to do this no more. This is not working out here. This is not working out because I need a green burrito. <laughs> this right here is right. Can you see that right here? This is that little bitty berry you know that you have that that you use on a pin cushion to sharpen your needles <laughs> well, we're gonna color that too and i'm not gonna wait to paint on this until you know i'm showing you guys this will be a like a, a work in progress kind of thing just like sewing i don't do sewing and you funny new you all the time today i am just covering the surface covering the surface and the paper's still wet so it's the um the paint kind of moves around a bit but that's okay that's okay i am just covering those circuits and it's going to be really fun to do these right here the pin heads because they're blue and yellow and green and all kind of colors and they all have reflections in them so it's going to be kind of, 
I don't know if anybody out there does any painting out there. Uh, it's kind of fun. I'm not great at it. I'm not, I don't do great. I will never do another big port picture. Uh, this is just fun now. This is just, just going to be for fun. Uh, so I'll be doing smaller pictures. And, uh, oops, see, I got some on there. That's okay. Because that is going to look like wood. And when you're painting, you do want some of your color that's everywhere else inside there. It, looks, it makes it look more, you know, realistic. Oh, don't forget this area. See? And then, the trick, I mean, I can go back with another color since it's still wet just a little bit and where it gets darker in areas I can just punch this in like, like in here and it's still wet so it will it'll seep through I go like that and it'll kind of blend which is fine See, this one right here, when I took that picture, I just made this, and it had glue on it. Right here, it's white because of glue, and I'm just, I'm just, uh, I'm doing, uh, what I think it would look like without the glue. So, I'm just going on. See how you kind of go, and it just kind of blends in. That needs a little more water there. Clean that up a little bit. Hope you guys enjoyed your tax day. I did because I was all done. It's been beautiful weather. You can always go back, and if it gets too dark, you just get your and just kind of pick up some of the water. And that's what I'm doing. I don't know how into this you guys are, or whatever. You know, you can leave it in the in the comments that you you know if you don't want it whatever i mean this 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 channel is just basically my crazy life so you're gonna get some crazy in there this is so relaxing And like I'm retired, so I can get me some relaxing things to do. Things that I can put down and not have to worry about. I did a picture of uh, my oldest son. A, a picture that was taken of him and me years ago. And then um, I did a picture of my middle son, Paul. Uh, I'll get those down and uh, show you. Uh, I haven't done a picture of my youngest son yet. I haven't picked it out. He's a hard one. And then uh, there are some pictures that I want to do, but I don't know if I could do them on YouTube. You know, there's one of, uh, oh, what was that guy's name? On the Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. The um, Candyman? There's a picture of him I want to do. I've been. I watched uh, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang the other day. I'm trying to watch uh, old movies that uh, that meant something to me when I was younger. I don't know why, but that I really enjoyed that. That's one of my favorite movies. I and I watched The Wizard of Oz. It's, it was, you know, it was just amazement to me the The Wizard of Oz one because you know how it goes from black and white to uh, color. That was like, oh, oh my God, that was magic to me. Yeah, sure was. I'm sure it was magic to a lot of kids. There's a lot of people that really are just crazy about uh, Wizard of Oz. 
This is just hours of fun right here. And it's basically working up the values that you want. And then after I get all that, the color right, then I go in and do my shading, the darkening. I got buttons. These are buttons right here with uh, um, pens in them. This is going to be dark. It does show a white spot over here and this, oops, right here. I'm going to leave that out. It's just going to be dark. And then the sewing machine. Oops, that was my little ginger right there. Um, this is sitting on the table of my sewing machine uh, where you put your hands through. I just set it there and took a picture. Well, I'm at 30 minutes. I'm washing this. I got to get off of here and go get some stuff done. Like, eat! I got, let's see, I got three and a half hours to eat. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna go slow. It's, it's gonna be, instead of a slow swing, this is gonna be a slow chew. Slow chew. Slow chew and paint. And enjoy the rest of my day. Because everybody's gone. Well, not everybody's gone. My son's in bed. My other son's at work. I don't, my other son's at work. And it's just quiet. And I love it. So, thank you for coming and enjoying my craziness. Or if you didn't enjoy it, yeah, yeah I'm sorry. Hey, I'm sorry. But uh, coming over and visiting with me for just a little bit on this beautiful Wednesday. This what you doing Wednesday. Uh, we'll see you on a Friday. Um, I got to pick up all my beautifully stacked cut pieces of my uh, border that I'm working on. So, thank you for th 313 subscribers. Thank you for all the likes and the comments. I appreciate those. Um, you guys have a wonderful day. Tammy Mia, I love you. Um, bye.